I mean, it was a prayer. Prayer is always for the benefit of someone. It's never against anyone. Maria Goldstein wanted 500 copies of her anti-abortion flyer, so she turned to this Schomburg Office Depot, where her request for copies was politely declined. I returned the call and was told by somebody else that my content was restricted by corporate policy. And you asked? And I asked, what is that corporate policy? Can you tell me? And they said, we don't know. I didn't see your flyer. The flyer is critical of Planned Parenthood, decrying what it calls the evil that has been exposed there, in part by hidden camera video taken by anti-abortion activists. But Maria says the idea was to encourage prayer, to turn some hearts. She says she got nowhere with Office Depot, so she got a lawyer from public interest law firm, the Thomas More Society. In my legal opinion, there's a pretty much an open and shut violation of the public accommodation law in Cook County, um, which provides that a, a, a company open to the public, serving the public, has to serve the public without unlawful discrimination. That is discrimination because of race, of religion, of national origin. This can't be allowed to happen in America, a country that was founded on freedom of religion. I mean, Office Depot tried to silence my freedom of speech, my freedom of religion. And that can't be allowed by any means for Jewish people, for Baptists, for any religion. We can't have that. Maria found another printing shop to make her copies, but she says she won't be satisfied until the company offers her an apology and an assurance that Office Depot won't do this to anybody else. So far, that hasn't happened. And as of right now, Office Depot has not responded to our requests for a comment. In the newsroom, Tom Negev and WGN News. Mark and Micah, back to you. Thank you, Tom.